and welcome everyone. We uh, have been dealing with quite a bit of cloud cover out here today, and now a few showers and storms going to grace us. They'll be moving through during the early overnight hours, and we'll have a drop in humidity going through the day tomorrow. It should feel rather pleasant with seasonable temperatures, and then uh, on late Friday, we'll see the humidity begin to climb back up as we head into the weekend, and could see a few more showers and a few thunderstorms, and picking those up. It looks like right now during the first half of the day on Sunday and then kind of clearing late. So this evening, we do have a slight risk of severe weather now over us for wind and hail. Going to be the main concerns out of some of these storms as they plow through uh, along a line. Here we are about uh, 1 a.m. or so. Everything kind of clears at that point. We'll just have some leftover cloud cover, maybe a little fog. And then we'll be dealing with clear skies and, again, ample sunshine. So out the door on our Thursday, everything should be dry by this point. This is just kind of picking up that chance closer to midnight. So we'll be in the upper 60s for morning lows. And then daytime highs, again, seasonable, right where we should be for this time of the year. Should make it up into the mid to upper 80s around the region. And notice we don't have much of a heat index. So our highs are pretty much going to match that heat index value. But then it climbs up as we go into Saturday with that humidity on the rise. And then it does cool off behind another cold front. So getting, again, some showers and storms late this evening. Into the day Thursday, I think we're pretty much going to be dry. Can't rule out a stray shower with some of the cooler air, but um, I really think it's going to be hard-pressed to pick up anything. So 85 for high, where we should be for this time of the year. 90 on Friday. The heat and humidity start to return, and better chance of storms late Saturday, really into the day on Sunday as another cold front comes through. High 83 Sunday, and then it cools off a little bit for Monday. And right now, the heat starts to build back in just in time for the 4th of July. 